Hello Critters and welcome back to Crafts and Critters with your host Christine. Um, thank you to the new subscribers. Um, welcome. I'm glad to um, have you. If you like this video, subscribe, uh, ring the bell and you'll get notifications of new videos. Today's video is um, we're going to make a wire wrap bracelet and we're going to use um, the beads that are in here. So these are butterflies. So let me just pull these out here. And there's all different kinds of sizes. So we got some small, and we got some large, and there's some medium sized ones in here. So we're going to um, work that. And I'm gonna adjust my mat a little bit. That'll make sure that I'm working in it. Okay, and we're going to need um, this is 20 gauge wire. Um, get this pretty much at any hobby bead store. So, um, and I know it comes in a variety of colors. I'm just going with the um, stainless steel silver, and then um, and then I've got my beading. Um, tools here that uh, we'll keep up here. So the first thing we're going to need is our little wire cutters and we're going to measure and I'm going to use my mat here that's kind of gridded and we're going to go with a little over, it's probably about 20 inches worth of wire that I'm going to go with. I'm going to clip that off, All right. and we're going to bring the ends together, and we're going to basically fold this in half, and we're going to go down to this end here, and we're just going to kind of round that out here, All right. and I'm going to grab my pliers here, and I'm going to Give this one, oops, hold on, let me grab a hold of it, one twist a little bit here, like so. Alright, so that's just one little twist. Alright, and then we are going to start putting on our butterflies. So I'm going to grab one under the wire. And I'm going to grab a butterfly, and we're going to make sure all these butterflies kind of go in the same direction. I'm going to pull it all the way down. Oops. Okay. And then we're going to give it a um, twist. So that's what we're looking like right there. And then I'm just going to grab another butterfly. Again, size and everything doesn't matter. Great. And I do want to make sure that all of the wire here that's going underneath to support the butterfly is on, going to be on the inside of the bracelet. So oh, it's, this will be just something that we'll have to uh, twist and play with as we go. Keep on going. Just grab random butterflies. 
random sizes, random colors. Keep making sure that they're all going in the same direction, which will help when it comes to forming the bracelet. Got a rhythm going here. So we're putting on a butterfly and I'm taking the one, putting it underneath, and then giving it a twist. And this will and this is helping to make sure that um, all of our wire, as you can see, I'm turning it upside down here real quick. So this will be the inside of our bracelet. This will be what the what will be on your inside of your wrist. So you'll only see the uh, these outside butterflies. Let's see. All right, I'm just gonna measure this out real quick. We are at four inches right now. We want to be at seven, so we're gonna keep going and adding more butterflies until we get to seven inches and then Oops, hold on. I got my butterflies backwards. There we go. Sometimes you gotta kind of twist it as you go to make sure that you're getting everything kind of in sync. Like this butterfly here that I just put on is backwards. So I'm gonna, gonna twist it. There we go. All right. And we're at almost six inches, so probably a couple more butterflies. Let's put a big one on. Big one, a couple little ones here. All right, you know what? I'm going to put one more on. It'll be a little bit over seven inches, but I'll make sure that uh, our bracelet is long enough. All right, so. Here's what we got right now, and here's the end. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut off the excess. I'm going to leave about that much right there. So that's where I'm going to cut it. Actually, let me give it a little bit more. There we go. Oh, that should be fine. All right, and even it out with. You can bring it to the other side so that you can make it even. And then you're cutting. All right. And then we're going to grab our round nose pliers. And we're going to separate these out. And we're going to. I actually made these too long. Hold on. Alright. 
Alright, so this will be the where the clasp will where it'll connect to a clasp. Alright. So the next thing we're going to make is the clasp, and that looks like, hold on, let me get my pliers here and lift this up so you can see it. All right. All right, that's this little guy here, and I'm going to show you how I made this. So you're going to go back to your 20 gauge wire. the end through here a little bit. All right. And you want two inches of this. All right. So once you have your two inches, you're going to fold it in half. Grab your pliers. Just going to squeeze it all together like so, and then you're going to round this out like so. You can kind of take and bend that down just a little bit so it'll kind of have a little curve to it. All right. And then for this end, you are going to take one side and roll it out, and take the other side and roll it out. Then you take your end of your bracelet, these two pieces that we curved down, you're going to slide that on, take your pliers, close these up, and then for your bracelet, we're going to have to we need to curve this. So I just grabbed something that's going to have a curve to it and you're going to just kind of bend it around there getting it to a nice round. This is also the time to straighten out like see this one here this um, see how it's not tilted right here so this would be their time to fix these butterflies and make sure all our butterflies are facing the correct way. So there we go. And then your clasp literally just clicks right here. So then there you go. There's our butterfly bracelet. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, and check out my Facebook page, uh, my Facebook group. There's a link in my um, description area, and you can post any craft items that you've made. Thank you.